Hi guys, this is Anderson from New Wave Revolution Heavy Metal Full Albums and I'm here to share some new projects that I have for 2019. But first I would like to thank you all of those who listened to this channel last year. It was a great year for the channel. And in May it's going to be three years of New Wave Revolution Heavy Metal Full Albums. I never told this to anyone but there's a series of reasons why I started this channel. One was because I realized that the bands, the classic bands that I was listening all the time, they were not going to be here forever. So I had to find new music to listen before they were gone. But another reason was because it was a therapy for myself. I, at the time I was away from my child, my daughter and my wife. They were living in the Netherlands and I had to go back to Brazil to apply for a visa to be able to live in the Netherlands as a legal immigrant and I in this process I stay a year uh, far from them it was very difficult I went through a depression I was sleeping throughout the whole day mostly without being able to do anything and the channel helped me a lot through these difficult times now things are better I'm with them and we have another son so uh, about the new projects before let me tell you something that happened in 2018 that I think it's nice to share uh, an important person in the metal scene posted on Facebook uh, calling out complaining about some YouTube channels that share albums Full albums from bands without their permission. On the post, several people commented, uh, New Wave Tradition have met full albums, he does the things right way, he always asks the bands for permission, he always asks the labels for permission, and I'm very thankful for these comments. Thank you so much, guys. And even the, the guy who posted the complaint. He acknowledged that he knew my work and I was doing things the right way. But I have to confess that when I started this channel, I had no idea what I was doing, doing things without knowing the consequences. But I learned a lot and things have changed and I try to do things the best way I can. Now it's official, but I have been working like this for a long time already. I'm only posting bands that either ask me to be on the channel, they request to be on the channel, or those who I reach out to and they give me permission to share their albums. So if your most anticipated album of 2019 is not on the channel or your favorite albums from previous years, they are not featured on the channel, it's because I couldn't get permission to post them. There are a few labels that I already made it clear that they don't want me to post their albums. I respect that. But I can't stop feeling a bit upset when I see the album that I want to post very much pop up in another YouTube channel. But what can I do? So one of the projects that I have is being more active in reaching out bands that I want to be on the channel. This means that I will contact bands more often saying that I want to share their albums on the channel. This will be very time consuming but it's what I can do to get the bands that I really want to be there. Because I get a lot of requests every day. Every day I get requests from, from bands and sometimes I cannot even answer immediately. As I said in a post I did on Facebook last year, many of the requests that I receive on, on my Facebook page or on my email, they are from bands that are not the style that I want to share on the channel. I receive a lot of requests of thrash metal bands. I love thrash metal. I have a lot of CDs of thrash metal on my collection. But this channel is new wave tradition of metal. And I even started sharing thrash metal in the past when I was starting the channel but thrash metal is a rabbit hole because old school thrash metal, new bands of old school thrash metal there are far far more bands than traditional heavy metal 
So, old school thrash metal deserves a channel and the channel exists. The channel is new wave of old school thrash metal is run by a Greek a Greek guy called Axel and he's a very nice guy. We are kind of friends and I always tell bands of thrash metal that request to be on the channel that they uh, seek to be on his channel new wave of old school thrash metal because that's the place for them so if i want to have the right bands that play the kind of metal that i created this channel to promote i have to reach out for them so i have to be more active in this the other project it's the the one that i'm most hopeful that will be a nice thing is the podcast. It's a podcast called A Wave of Metal. I will explain all the first episode why it's called A Wave of Metal. And I recorded two days ago. My first guest was Travel Winning Church from Hunt. And we have a great conversation. And I will share a short clip of the interview with you. Today we are talking with Travel Winning Church from Hunt. Hello there, everybody. How's it going? Hey, Travel. How is it for you to be part of one of the hottest bands in metal at the moment? Um, <coughs> sorry, I'm smoking a joint. Um, it's really awesome. Um, the the whole um, experience that I've had this past year has been incredible because. I didn't have like a band until April, so to like form a band out of what was just a fun little recording project in 2017, turning into a band that ends up getting all this publicity is quite nice, to be honest with you. I didn't expect that, you know? So it's, it's really cool. I really dig it. So this is on the first episode of A Wave of Metal, the podcast. I just need to record a few more episodes to start putting them online. And because I started this podcast, I decided to open space for sponsors who want to one episode or a series of them. Gladly I had a sponsor for the first episode already and you will see on the, the, the episode. But I opened for more of them because it's needed. I had to pay the hosting. I have to pay for the apps to record the conversation. And if things get more professional, I will have to buy equipment such as microphones and these kind of things. So we are open for sponsors. And I also created a Patreon, a Patreon page. So if you want to donate, if you want to contribute to the new podcast and also to the channel, you can do it through the Patreon and I will be very thankful if you do this so you can help me to continue promote these awesome bands that I have here. This is all new wave of tradition have metal. The other projects that I have, they will have to wait a little bit because they need a financial investment that I'm I can't do now. One of them is going to festivals that are open to new wave fresh and have metal bands like Keep It True, True and High, Their Dads, Up the Hammers, and just to name a few ones. Go there and talk to the bands, interview the bands in the context of the first fall, if allowed to record short clips of the bands. Uh, performing live and share on the channel to give Headbangers Worldwide a sense of what you can feel when you are in one of these celebrations of heavy metal. Going to one of these festivals can be quite ex expensive. You have the, the tickets. The tickets are not so expensive, but you have the transportation that can uh, cost a lot. So at the moment I can't do these things because I don't have a regular job. I'm working freelance, but it's it's not nearly enough. And the last project is that I 
I'm thinking about starting my own PR agency to promote bands on social media because I notice a lot of bands with, with talent but they can't seem to market themselves the right way to be able to reach. And the last project is that I'm thinking about starting my own PR agents to promote bands on social media because I see a lot of bands that they have talent but they don't know how to market themselves the right way to achieve bigger things. I have noticed a lot of bands being signed after they are shared on my channel and I think this is uh, amazing but I want to be able to release them myself sometime. So this is it guys, these are the projects that I have in mind and I hope you guys like the ideas and if you, uh, once again, if you want to donate to help these projects take off, the link is on the description. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.